Hi. In this video, I'd like to show um, a Russian traditional spread using Lenormand cards. Uh, usually, it's used with 36 playing cards, but um, I'm going to use Lenormand. And it's also 36, so it's going to come out right. First of all, we're going to use significator. If you're a woman, you're using woman. If you're a man, you're using the man. So, the first step is to look for a significator. Of course, you set the time frame uh, of the reading. For example, one month, two months, three months. And it'll, it's just a general reading. You don't need an exact question. Uh, it'll show anyway. I think what's important right now, what, what you have problems and stuff. So, I'm just going to look for myself in, in this three cards. Look for my own card. Woman's card. I found woman's card. And uh, I can read these three cards. Snake, flowers, and woman. Well, it's a woman, woman, woman. So uh, there are many women surrounding me. Um, it can be relative, mother, mother-in-law, and the other ladies. You can see all this are ladies. It can be beauty, things women do, and feminine things. So yeah, the housework and the house stuff and the beauty and the, I don't know. But it's feminine stuff, yeah? Somewhat. And yeah, it's true. It doesn't show my future because I'm the last card. It shows my uh, past. Yeah, what happened before. So I'm just... It's optional, by the way, to do this. Just picking out my significator, this woman card, and shuffling back all the other cards. Shuffling, shuffling. And thinking of a time frame. For example, I want to know three months. Three months. Okay, so we take first three cards and put them under the main card, woman's card, and they mean under the heart. Under the heart shows our subconscious emotions, subconscious thoughts, subconscious what's happening that we're not even aware of. Uh, these three cards go on top, they are called on the heart, uh, and they show our emotion, emotions in general, what's our emotional state recently. Now, we basically cross this, like this, Oops. we cross this like this, it's too thin. And this is our, what's on our mind, what are we thinking, planning, and so on. So we put, uh, I think, like this, one card like this, and two cards like this. So this is what we're thinking at the moment. The card closest to the significator is uh, red first, and the two cards red afterwards, like first hearts, then anger and then um, ring or it can be that this first happens and this happens and this happens now we we'll take the down one below one and again we do the same take one card and pull two other ones uh, oops it's not fitting two other ones and this shows um what is happening right now is the present and again we read first this and this and this now take the card the pile on the left and do the same pull one put it like this pull two put it like this and this is our past what happened now this will happen first then this then this and it's read first beer then cross then lilies now this is the future what's gonna happen and we put like this 
like this and like this so this is what's gonna happen now we have these other cards so we also put it like this diagonally and uh, this can be like a clock like a time frame um, I'll explain later and another card we put here the other we put here the other you put here so uh, there are left some uh, cards uh, some cards are left one two three four five they can be as an advice so uh, now how to interpret this diagonal cards this is kind of like held to cross which is easy to understand now these diagonal cards can be used as a clock so if this is the present this is the past so this can mean how past influences the present this uh, here it can mean uh, for example this is the past and this is our thoughts so how past influences our thoughts this can be uh, this is our thoughts right now and future so um, something about uh, our current thoughts that affect the future so it shows how our current plans um, how they're affecting the future or it can be interpreted as a very soon future very near future this one here this is future and this is the present so it can be that uh, what we do in the present to affect the future so you can think of this whatever you like i mean there are different versions of a reader has their own preference some are just uh, show it as a time frame but uh, even to make it a more precise prediction, for example, if this is the present, this is the past. So some, something between present and past, very near to past. And this, for example, this is the past and this is the thoughts. So um, current thoughts, so this is something like what influence does the past have on the thoughts right now? Uh, and uh, yeah, and this is current thoughts and the future so how current thoughts what influence do they have on the future and uh, this is the present so this is the future and then actions or thoughts between uh, present and future yeah so first of all uh, these are interpreted um, not necessarily first of all but um, I prefer first of all so what's uh, the current um, you know state of mind so you see these three cards and it shows uh, there's some pain related to the mind that is being secret and revealed uh, there's uh, can be some something with the brain some of the dreams something that is not being communicated or unknown yeah and okay you can do this with a tarot as well playing cards as well now emotional level okay it shows a man being emotional over a man and it's, it has this romantic uh feel to it yeah romantic feel some a man is important the woman maybe has it's my by the way my spread <laughs> woman has a, my, a man on mind yeah and it's very romantic very emotional so we're just putting it back now uh my then it's uh done like this first thoughts um so my thoughts is, I can put it like that. Uh, some decisions, uh, some related with relationship again. Sort of relating a relationship, decision regarding a relationship. The future, no, first, uh, the current situation is snake, dog, and flower. Again, it shows, uh, well, woman friends can be friends, something talking to friends it can be that man uh, it can be some hanging out with two women and a man or just you know people enjoying friendships now the past is um, 
<clears throat> the bear, the cross, and the lily, the bear, cross, and lily. So something very heavy, traditional appearance, maybe traditions, blah, 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 functions. Um, can't confirm that, not sure, but I live with my in-laws, so it can be anything. Uh, future is child, coffin, and son. Child, coffin, and son. Well, some worries about a child. Uh, maybe a fever coming for the child to the poop. And now we're going to look at uh, this. So this is uh, my current situation. This is my past. How past influences my current situation, let's see. So we have a ship, we have a whip, and a tree. Uh, um, repeated journey to another city or another country. Family, something. Family, traveling with the family. We had a holiday. Maybe I'm missing my family because I live in another, another country. And I'm just doing fast. I'm not really interpreting properly. So this family, this family, maybe it has some connection. And here I'm talking to some women friends. <clears throat> also in the family, there are more women than men. So I'm hanging, hanging around with women more. Uh, yeah, now how past affects my current plans and, you know, thoughts. Some problems with the house again. Uh, issues with the family again. I thought how to, how was it? <laughs> yeah. Then how my future plans affect the, how my plans and thoughts currently affect my future. Well, heart, stalk, and fox. So it's warning me that I wouldn't do anything stupid um, <clears throat> uh, regarding my wishes. And it says, uh, even if you want something, you have to be careful because it can be not working out. Sometimes a fox can mean a job. Maybe a favorite job, a job you like. Maybe your hobby will lead you to a job or something. Because I'm jobless. So that can be the case, but not sure. Doesn't show really. Now, this is future and present. Uh, let's see future's actions, how they affect the uh, present's uh, actions. How do they affect the future? So we have a fish, garden, and tower. Well, it shows like an office job, or I don't know. It can be uh, being um, singled out from the public, being um, closed up from the public and not communicating much, not going out much, sitting in a jail, in a tower, which is kind of truth. It also can uh, mean a public place, financial public place like a, a place like a building where there are many people maybe shopping in a mall or something i don't know three months long time hard to check need to record it um now advice that i'm getting is clouds it's clever it's writer it's mice and letter advice clouds clever writer mice and okay first of all this and this means messages some things and related with communication and expressing your thoughts uh, clouds have this confused feel and uh, clever is uh, a luck unhappiness or um, spontaneous maybe you know, spontaneous something spontaneous negative something and this talks about uh, spontaneous negative uh, fast communication expression of thoughts uh, or actions moving movement and mice usually is a loss and something also negative so message be aware of what you talk be aware of the what you say to others what you uh, what messages you deliver also and messages talk about media like YouTube so be careful what you post on YouTube because I posted a funny um, crime video 
previously, so I'm afraid that it's not a good idea. But I think because you're confused and you're not sure, so it's better not to do it, not to say it, or just this is my how I see it. Okay, so uh, also in this spread, a very big importance, especially with playing cards, have the cards that are in a circle around the significator. So uh, these cards are also red, and it's it, it's real bad if the bad cards are here. It can the circle is also red basically, yeah. For example, um, key is important, paths is choice, the heart is uh, your feelings, this child is your children, fish is freedom or money, uh, snake is cheating or just woman, and far away, distance, and some person, again, a superior person. There are two people, again, uh, child is of extreme importance and um, uh, can be a younger person uh, we have three persons here actually um, so something related with relationships and right decisions and being nice to the people being aware um, be careful of cheating um, a man is important and someone from the far away yeah and yeah that's um, idea for, for that's a, sorry for, uh, we have then we have a uh, next circle these cards uh, they can also be read as uh, further influence further message and these cards can be read um, as a even further message and influence so and there are more better variations probably of this but this is how I decided to do it after watching many videos and researching the spread Okay, so thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you like it.